Highway 17 going through Lake Superior Provincial Park in Ontario. It is the drive between Sault Ste. Marie and Thunder Bay, I think, is one of the most beautiful drives. It takes you through beautiful wooded areas along the side of Lake Superior. Um, some of the sites are just breathtaking all moments, you know, those moments that we look for. And um, so I hope you all are doing well. I'm going to a place called Pickle Lake. And Pickle Lake is the most northern part of Ontario that you can drive to. So that's where the paved road ends, apparently. So you know I am about seeing where the road ends. So I decided that um, I'd come up north, take a look at the beautiful colors. I was coming up through Perry Sound and it was really colorful up there, coming along up there. And I thought, oh no, you know, because that's like pretty south to where I'm going or even where I am. So I thought, oh, I hope the colors aren't done, but they're not. There's still a lot of green. I'm um, not even, I think I'm probably still eight to 10 hours away from Pickle Lake. If you go to Thunder Bay and you turn right and you drive for 530 kilometers, there's the end of the road. So I'm really looking forward to uh, to seeing what's up there. Um, I don't I don't even know. Like I didn't really do a whole lot of research other than you know I've known because I've, I've perused the north before, so I know that uh, that Pickle Lake is the most northern destination you can drive to but I didn't really do any research to see what's up there or, but like I said, you know, I'm just kind of um, puttering along, stopping here, stopping there. This provincial park is absolutely beautiful. Although I've never actually stayed in the provincial park itself, like in the campground, I've stayed along the byways and highways of this provincial park a couple times, got away with it. Um, uh, the one time um, I had a cop pull in but it was like, I don't know minus holy shit and he didn't want to get out of his car I guess and so he just uh, ran my plates I guess and then left <laughs> which, is, which is perfect, right? which is perfect thanks for uh... oh, there's a scenic lookout coming up so Let's drop into the scenic lookout. There's all kinds of these along this highway. And look at this, man. It looks like I'm going to drive off the edge of the earth there. Um, and, and really, I love them. I just love them. This is just like what I stayed at in the wintertime. Only they had plowed it like up to this point. And I think it was for the fishermen or something. But, so let's take a look and see the beauty that it is. Wow. Just wow. Mother Nature is the most beautiful painter, isn't she? I don't know if I can even turn this camera for you to see, but I'll try. It's kind of dull out. I've actually pulled it right off. So let's shut her down for a minute. And let's go take a look. Uh, unlocking the door. Taking the keys out of the ignition because isn't that an annoying noise? But you know what? If it wasn't for that noise, um, I'd lock my keys in the car, in the van, way more often. So. Let's move it in. Wow. 
so very pretty. So I'm going to carry on my way. It kind of looks like it's raining over there. It rained for a little while this morning. I thought that would lift the fog, but it brought the fog. And uh, so I kind of delayed me a little bit, but I'm retired. So delay is okay. <laughs> well, I hope you all are having a great day. I'm going to carry on and see what's around the next corner. Have a good one. Don't forget to check out my blog. Wait for the truck to go by. Don't forget to check out my blog at chipmunksrvlife.com. Hit the like button and the subscribe button so you don't miss a chipmunk adventure. It's getting exciting. See you soon.